Welcome to the Cartographer's Quest. My name's Landon and you're watching RPG ABC and we have been playing the Cartographer's Quest which is a mini campaign that the that Sundial Games has been releasing during their 2024 Quest Calendar Kickstarter and today is another update. So first we're going to go through the Kickstarter update news. Currently, they, at time of recording, they're at $252,910, which means they have hit every stretch goal that they've had so far. So, the finish line is right there. They only have 41 hours to go on this Kickstarter. Please, if you have not backed them, go back them. They make a wonderful product, and I think you will enjoy it. Even if it's just the PDF file for 7 bucks, I think. Maybe it's 9 I don't know. But that's still worth it. So, uh, they are in the final stretch here. And they've added one more stretch goal just to see if we can hit it. And it is... Oh, two more stretch goals. I did not see that before. Um, two more stretch goals. One is for a third color of marker. Could be useful. I prefer the ones that the wonderful viewer Craig sent me. That's these ones here. I will put them up on screen there. I got a new webcam as well, so if the table is looking different, that is why. Uh, but also, it looks like at 280,000, 280,000, uh, we will also be getting extra note pages in the Hero Book. Definitely a awesome uh, product that they have. If you watch the Void Spark Chronicles, you will see me using that Hero Book. It is a fantastic product. Absolutely recommend it. Um, Let's see, discount to all returning backers. Uh, I'm wondering what this is. All returning backers will get an additional $4 of credits to use in their pledge manager once the Kickstarter has ended. So if you have done one of their Kickstarters before, definitely um, check out this Kickstarter. Make sure you back and get your $4 credit to put towards wherever you want. That's a fantastic gift from Sundial Games to us. I actually didn't back it last time. Uh, Void Spark Chronicles, I got way later. So I won't get this, but congratulations to everyone that does. And uh, thank you so much for backing it before because then I found it and I fell in love with it. So awesome. Um, looks like we do have a winner for the, uh, the poll that they did for the mini dice. And it looks like we're going with the sparkles. I preferred the translucent, but the sparkles still look good. Um, and orange, as always, is amazing because of the, um, you know, my wife has MS and orange is the color of the ribbon for people with MS and all that stuff. So, yeah, we've got some art, uh, a video. I'm not going to play it. Go ahead and check it out yourself. But uh, we also have some coloring pages that uh, you can download, print out. Doesn't even look like you have to back for this. You, you can just do that and color your hero how you want. That's pretty cool. Now on to today's cartographer quest, which is what, day seven, I believe? The tunnel you went in leads to another mining area. Other workers are digging at a massive cache of amber, and they haven't spotted you yet. So we have one A, one B. So when it's, it is A or B, we can choose to do either one. Uh, we can cause a distraction or time. Uh, try to move their movements. Try, try to time their movements. That's what it is. Um, let's see. We are pretty good at investigation. I do think that's the better one. Uh, so we are going to do that. We are also an investigator. So we have plus four in this. We're using the uh, uh, investigator ability here which it also reminds us on screen of that. And we will go ahead and roll for this. This is plus four because our intellect is plus two and we have investigator. 18 plus four is a 22. That's pretty good. So let's go ahead, scroll down. If the result is 12, nope, that's the wrong one. There we go. If the result is 12 or more after observe, after observation you discover a rhythm to their movements and work one of the miners works to chip away at amber while another le loads the cart once the cart is loaded full it is hauled away and the workers switch positions uh, you can get past if you go at the right time gain a plus two bonus to sneak on number two so that's so cool number two is sneak 
past in the shadows. You roll a dexterity check. Um, dexterity for us is plus one. So the plus two from before is going to be pretty useful. And I don't think any of our abilities help. So it will just be a plus three in total. Let's see what happens. That is a two. Plus three is five. No, no. Um... If the result is 13 or less, a miner spots you and attacks. If you have Grateful Companion written down uh, from earlier, your friend haunts the... I don't think we have... I never wrote down Grateful Companion. Oh, no. My companion was not grateful. Um, so it looks like we go into combat here. So our attack is plus one. Um, but our ability, once per page, add your in intellect to a single attack roll. I'm going to choose this. Um, this is scary. They spotted us and they're attacking. We're going to have plus three because we're adding our intellect to this attack roll. So that is six plus three is nine. And their defense is ten. We miss. I think we like swing and they just block it with their tool or something. Um... So we miss, and they attack us. So we need to roll defense. Our defense is plus two. Let's see. Um, nope, Springtail does not help here. So we're going to go ahead and roll defense at plus two. Uh-oh. That's another six. Plus two is eight. Their attack. If, they're, if your defense roll equals or excels the enemy's attack roll... Reduce your health uh, your health by the enemies. Otherwise, reduce your health by the enemy's full damage. Full damage being one. Okay, okay. We're down to five hit points. Five hit points. Not doing too bad. I think we only have one more page to go. Hopefully two, but we'll have to wait and see. Um, but yeah, the quest is coming to an end. And so is the Kickstarter. So be sure to check out the Kickstarter if you haven't yet. Thank you so much for watching. Go ahead, like this video. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on the next Cartographer's Quest video. Also, be sure to check out the Void Spark Chronicles video because I'm playing the 2023 Quest Calendar every single day this year, and it is a lot of fun. Um, even if you haven't gotten the Quest Calendar yourself for 2023, you can still watch those videos and just... Join me on my adventure, but I would recommend getting the PDF at the very least and playing along because that's fun as well. Um, let's see. What else is there? Uh, uh, join the Discord if you want to talk quest calendar, uh, play a tabletop role-playing game with me, or something else which is coming soon. So be sure to check that out as well. And of course, until next time, keep rolling dice.